will you play behind the scenes with me? Sure. It's behind the scenes. <laughs> I want to go to postcards from the edge um, because it's one of my favorite scenes from you. It's one of my favorite movies. And I just love this so much. What was it like? to work with Meryl Streep? Uh, so, you know, I mean, I met Meryl, but it was like, hello, hi, nice to meet you. And then, so we're doing the scene, and I'm very nervous, because it's Meryl Streep. Mm -hmm. And um, we did it, you know, we practiced it, rehearsed, and then after we were rehearsing, I heard, cut. Now, that means it's not a rehearsal. Mm -hmm. That means they're shooting film. And in those days, of course, I didn't understand how valuable that was. And what I learned was, no, 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 maybe some better things happen because you actually aren't worried that it's the thing that's going to be on film. And, and watching her was great because what I noticed with her is she never did it the same way because that's what talent is. She wasn't locked into doing it a way, which is, of course, the whole deal. Have you <laughs> seen I didn't know her that then. now? Do you see her anytime recently? Like, do you ever run into her? I was, so we were both at the Golden Globes, and she came up to me and told me she liked Nyad. <laughs> and I was like, wow, it's never a bad moment <laughs> when Meryl Streep comes up and says, good job. And that is literally my point. That is the way that Nyad will affect you when you see it. Um, okay, the last but certainly not uh, least, um, where you met your extraordinary husband, Bugsy. Um, so my husband and I uh, are about to celebrate 32 years of marriage. <laughs> Pretty good. Um, and yeah, so he was making this movie. So they hired me to play the woman in the movie, and yeah, we fell in love. So um, was it love at first sight? Um, well, he says it was love at first sight, <laughs> 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 but I think what well, you know. Um, so for me, you know, I have to be honest. So I was going to meet him, and um, so he's uh, he was incredibly intelligent. That's my that was honestly my the most. Um, the, the, the biggest aphrodisiac. Mm -hmm. Funny and super smart. That's it. That's the two. Now, he's also very handsome. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't hurt. <laughs> it didn't hurt. He's not Warren but, Beatty for nothing. Yeah, but um, I, I thought, wow, this is, uh, this is quite a guy. But, so, but I, did, I really thought about it professionally, to be honest. I really did when I first met him. I didn't think that there would ever be like a thing between us. And it's, a, it's, you know, it's the greatest, um, I think marriage is like the greatest thing and the greatest challenge to, to really make it all work and to make and to stay together. And that is the thing that I am so, so proud of with us. I mean, I, it's just, you're the most impressive person, uh, both personally and professionally. Thank and you. to hear Thank you. from you and to watch, especially in Nyad, like to the demonstration of how we persevere in this world mm. and in this life. And the water isn't new to you, you were on a boat when you were younger, and somehow you landed a job as a cook on a boat? Yes, yeah, so I was a scuba diver in San Diego, um, and in order to get your certification, you have to do a beach dive, but then you also have to do a boat dive. And we did that, and then I realized they needed a cook. I didn't know enough to know that I couldn't do that, and then I was, I was not very good, just, um, just so you know. I made like, Grilled cheese sandwiches, hamburgers. So, but it, I did it for a year. 